Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I have with me my gorgeous Luch, Luch, Luciano. <laughs> Sorry if I can't say it right. Luciano, um, dressed as a girl. Um, and this beautiful bub was reborn by Tiffany from Coco's Nursery here in Australia. Um, today I have a really, really interesting um, and important story time for everyone. And I think it's got a really um, good message in there. So I wanted to share that with you today. It's a little bit of a scary thing, but I just think it's important to get it out there. And for people, if this happens to you in the future, you know exactly what to do. Uh, I'm just sitting in my beauty room at the moment, so excuse all of the, you know, non-reborn stuff that you see um, laying around. But um, yeah, so this is the story time that I just discovered today that I thought would be really important for everyone in our community to be aware of. So um, recently somebody posted in a reborn group, Facebook reborn group, a story about an incident that happened to them. I'm not sure how recent it is. I think it was very recent actually, like re really last few days. Um, but I'm not hundred percent sure on that, but just the way it was written, it sounded very recent. So what had happened was she had, um, decided to go out shopping and she decided to, she wanted to take her reborn out with her and she had um, put the reborn in the pram all looking you know real as we all do and she went out and she went into the shop and she was shopping and she had to grab something that was a little bit further away from where she was so she just left her pram there for a second and she just turned her back and walked a little bit and was grabbing something and when she turned around her reborn was gone I kid you not she was so shocked when she looked into the pram and there was nothing there so she quickly stopped and she was looking everywhere around and she saw a lady with what it looked like her her baby her reborn in their arms walking away so she quickly left the pram she just started running towards this woman and stopped her and she said um, to the lady, excuse me, that's mine. And the lady said, oh, the, he reminded me so much of my um, um, warning here. This is a little bit graphic. He reminded me so much of my dead newborn son. And she said, Look, I'm really sorry to hear that, but this is my um, mine. So I'm going to take him back. So she took the baby, the reborn back. And she quickly went back to the pram. She quickly put him back, paid for him or her, whichever it was. I'm not sure what sex the actual reborn was. She paid for her things and she left immediately and she's posted about this on Facebook. Now, a lot of people um, are saying in the comments, including myself, that we feel strongly that she should report that incident um, to the police and the reason why a lot of people are saying that is that it, that lady did not know that that was a reborn in the pram and she has gone in and taken, scooped up that reborn, which she thought was a baby, and she has started to, to walk away with it, run away with it, whatever. And I just personally feel that um, that the public could be in danger of this woman. I do have a lot of sympathy for her. But the reality is you can't go around taking people's babies. Even, even if she did know it was a reborn, you can't go around stealing. That's theft. But the most concerning thing was that I am pretty sure that she wouldn't have known it was a reborn and that she would have just thought it was a sleeping newborn and she scooped that up and took it. So I just think of all the potential mothers out there um, that are at risk of this lady who's obviously very disturbed and got some serious emotional issues and I just feel that it would be in the best interest for everybody in the community for this lady to be reported to the police. Um, the store would have had security um, vision cameras that could be reviewed so that we, they can find the identity of this woman and uh, and it would be to for her to get help so that she doesn't go and do this again to potentially another real baby so this was like really shocking like I do remember once 
I was in Spotlight a few years ago and there was this adorable, quite not newborn, newborn, but quite young baby in a pram. And there was the mom and I think her friend or something was there. And I was shopping in that sort of aisle and just the baby just kept catching my eye. It was just really dressed cute and just <clears throat> was a really cute baby. And I just my eye just kept being drawn to this baby. I just couldn't help looking at it. And I noticed that the mum had seen me, noticed me like looking at this baby and and she got really nervous and she left the island and I didn't feel, I, I mean, I felt a little bit awkward myself, but I totally understood that she started to get a bit creeped out, you know, by me looking so much at her baby that she, luckily her instincts kicked in, you know, with protective instincts and she um, moved away from me, which I don't blame her. I probably would have done the same thing if it was my child. Um, and I just wanted to put it out there in the community that, you know, um, that this can happen. And if, and I also wanted to really put out there that if you have your reborn out and something like this was to happen to you, I would strongly urge you to contact the police because this lady that the whole story was about the original one she was just like oh but it was just a doll you know and she felt a bit awkward and uncomfortable about reporting that to the police but the main principle of this whole thing is that that lady is probably more than likely didn't know it was a reborn and was potentially stealing a baby and that is you know so bad that the police have to be aware of this in case something in the future happens so don't, please don't feel awkward. Like if it happened to me legit, if I was out and about with one of my reborns and someone was to take one of my reborns, I would go straight and, you know, obviously I'd get the, the reborn back. But after that, the first thing I would do is report it to the police because I think they need to be aware of this sort of thing. So I really want to draw opinion as usual because, um, you know, that's what our community is all about. Everyone's different opinions. So I would love to know your opinion. Do you agree with me that this incident was very serious and needs to be reported as soon as possible? Or would you be like the the person in the story and be too embarrassed to go and report it to the police? Um, I can understand that some people would be embarrassed about it. I totally understand that. But just to me, I my embarrassment would be um I would still be slightly embarrassed but that embarrassment to me would not be worth me potentially not reporting it and having this woman um actually do it to a real baby so I would put I would put my embarrassment last and the safety of the community first that's just what I would do I would love to know what you would do or if you've heard of anything similar stories happening if something similar has happened to you maybe you've also had someone like because I we're so attracted to babies the, the way you know the way they look that we do tend to look a lot so has that ever happened to you where someone's felt uncomfortable with you looking at their baby or has someone been looking at your reborn, something like they were going to take it or have actually taken it? So just love to hear all your stories and your thoughts on this. Um, just thought it was really interesting discussion time for today's video. And obviously this girl is just looking so gorgeous here um, in this really pink frilly thing I love it so much but yeah that's it for today hopefully you enjoyed my story time um and uh well it's not my story but it's someone else's story and I just think it's really interesting and it's a good lesson or story that we can all think about so that if we think about it now and it happens we sort of have already thought about that scenario and we can always just act straight away we don't need to think about it and process it at the time so yeah anyway thanks for watching don't forget to give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it today and don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more of my reborn collection i have lots more babies i love to share with you so until next time thanks for watching and see you later have an awesome day bye